Good afternoon. Today, the Supreme Court has judged that the Rwanda policy requires a set of changes in order to be lawful. I do not agree with this decision, but I respect it and accept it. The rule of law is fundamental to our democracy. We have prepared for all outcomes of this case. And so we have been working on a new international treaty with Rwanda. This will provide a guarantee in law that those who are relocated from the UK to Rwanda will be protected against removal from Rwanda. And it will make clear that we will bring back anyone if ordered to do so by a court. We will finalise the treaty in light of today's judgment and ratify it without delay. But we need to end the merry-go-round. I said I was going to fundamentally change our country, and I meant it. So I'm also announcing today that we will take the extraordinary step of introducing emergency legislation. This will enable Parliament to confirm that with our new treaty, Rwanda is safe. It will ensure that people cannot further delay flights by bringing systemic challenges in our domestic courts and stop our policy being repeatedly blocked. But of course, we must be honest about the fact that even once Parliament has changed the law here at home, we could still face challenges from the European Court of Human Rights in Strasbourg. I told Parliament earlier today that I'm prepared to change our laws and revisit those international relationships to remove the obstacles in our way. So let me tell everybody now, I will not allow a foreign court to block these flights.